Hello, and welcome back to Chapter 7 of RM Study. In this module, we'll discuss one of the techniques for performing the quantitative analysis process, expected monetary value. Expected monetary value, or EMV, allows the user to calculate the weighted average value of an event that includes uncertain outcomes. It's well suited to decision tree analysis. This technique incorporates both the probability and impact of uncertain events using simple calculation that doesn't require special software. Critical success factors for the technique include the identification of all possible events that need to be included in the EMV calculation, access to historical data or expert opinions on the values of probability and impact that are needed for the calculation of EMV, and understanding of the difference between EMV and the output of simulation tools, such as Monte Carlo analysis. There are several weaknesses to be wary of when using this technique. Assessment of probability of risky events occurring and of their impact can be difficult to make. EMV provides only the expected value of uncertain events. Risk decisions often require more information than EMV can provide. And it's sometimes used in situations where Monte Carlo simulation would be more appropriate and provide additional information about risk. The EMV calculation for an event by weighting the individual possible outcomes by their probabilities of occurring is shown in the figure given here. And with that, we've come to the end of this module. In the next session, we'll move on to the Fault Tree Analysis, or FMEA. Until then, goodbye and thanks for watching.